All right, so for this wallet, I'm actually going to give two ratings. No, pick one. Pick one. You're always trying to give two of something. No, I'm not always... always trying to give two of something. Right, two is... honorable mentions. Two of everything. No, pick one rating. Down to the socks, like a baby. YouTube is good. Welcome back to our channel. My name is Kenya. My name is Sebastian. He's the S. She's the K. And this is SNK Millennial, Millennial Living. Living. So today we're talking about the Gucci King Snake Wallet. All right, the Supreme Double G. All right, guys. So we're just gonna keep this one short and sweet. All right. Right now we're gonna talk about. What we think about the wallet, how it looks. Kenya, what do you think about this wallet? I don't like it really. I don't know. I'm just not a fan of like showy things. And I feel like a lot of Gucci products are super showy with the snake across it and the the logo imprints in the back behind it. I was just like, this is too much going on. Like, I feel like if it was just the the GG in the back, I could have I could have got with it, but I don't know. The snake is just like doing too much for me, personally. I know you like this wallet because nah, you guys see my opinion. I actually do not. I, I actually like the way this wallet looks. Like I, the first time, like I was so I was looking I was looking for a genuine leather wallet, and I wanted something that was really nice. And I just I really wasn't feeling most of what I saw, so I went up and. I was actually talking to a coworker and she convinced me like, yo, like, why don't you just look at this one? So I looked at it, I'm like, nah, like I'm really feeling this. Like I like the the artwork and the quality of the, so this is actually canvas on the outside. The quality of the work is actually really, really nice. I'm really a big fan of this right here. But one of my concerns is the value of it right the price versus the actual quality of the wallet but we'll talk about that in a few all right guys so here we have the gucci king snake wallet this is the front of the wallet here we have the back of the wallet when you open it up that beautiful king snake oh man this thing looks beautiful and it feels beautiful as well but this is a waxed canvas all right guys this side is not leather this is a waxed canvas now, if you flip it over here, we can see all the leather. We have the leather trimmings around then we have the leather pockets. As you see, we have the space fillers for the cards, but I also leave these in because it makes it easier for me to take out my cards. So if you open the top of the wallet up, you can see that although it is right here, they have the leather trimming. This right here is canvas. And then we have the bill separator right here. This is canvas. So this is the bill pocket and this is the receipt pocket. Or you can put bills in both, it's up to you. Then we have eight of the leather pockets. These are also trimmed in leather. Let me open this up for you. So it's trimmed in leather, but the inside is canvas. It's the same thing on this side as well. So once again, leather trim, canvas pocket. Leather trim, the canvas lining pocket. Right, and that's pretty much throughout the whole wallet. Down here, it says Gucci made in Italy. All right. And as you can see up here, guys, well, actually, it's down here, sorry. There's a bit of wear, and this is from only about six months right there. Actually, no, here we go. Here's the wear. You see, as the wax that's supposed to be binding the canvas and the leather, the wax right here is it's peeling off already. And guys, all I do is put this in my pocket, right? I don't do anything too strenuous. You see the wax right there? Okay, so that's definitely something to think about when you're buying this wallet. I think this wallet is beautiful, but I do not think that it is worth the price. When you're going for the King Snake wallet, if it is something that you are interested in, there are multiple King Snake wallets. You have the coin purse, you have the the four pocket, I believe, wallet, and then you have this one, which has eight pockets, right? And this one is 410. The four pocket, I believe, is 395, 
and then the coin purse wallet is $295. And we'll have the information in the description below. Remember guys, over here we do have our own specific rating system. It goes from, nah, I'm good, meh, it's all right, I like it, and it's a keeper. So Sebastian, what do you think about this wallet? I'm putting this wallet at a like and not a love or have to keep it because the value is just not there for me. In all honesty, I'm going to be like completely clear with you guys. Like it's I like I said, I like the design. The leather quality on it is cool. I guess the, the canvas actually is really high quality, but the, the bonding with the wax kind of throws me off the fact that it's a $400 wallet kind of throws me off and I feel that if you guys want a leather wallet you should just go out and get a genuine leather wallet you could actually make one yourself like I'm I plan on doing that later this year or you can if you want a wallet with a design just get like a wallet with a design like a canvas wallet where you're not paying $400 maybe a hundred something like that but I wouldn't recommend this for someone else. But for me, I definitely, it's def, definitely a like for me. How about you, Kenny? I already know what you're gonna say. I am putting it at its eye um, because it is a decent wallet. It's very sturdy. I just think, again, the design is not really my cup of tea. And then the price is also not my cup of tea. So it's I. You can definitely find, I think, a better wallet, better quality wallet, or for my personal taste, better looking wallet <laughs> in other retailers or for cheaper. Yeah, I agree. Remember guys, all information regarding this wallet will be in the description below. So don't forget to check that out and don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And what do they need to do? Hit the bell.